Look at the weather, guys. Look at the weather, drizzly, dreary, and depressing. But you know what? We got something to be excited about. Check it out. Oh, look at that. That's a Super Bowl ring. Look oh, at this. How neat. We have a bunch of poker chips. Kiss, Giants. Oh, there's the Undertaker. Okay, what else we got here? Waiting for the postman. Keep digging. Another book. All right, some cables and cords. Ooh, this one's getting going downhill. It's going getting dull. <laughs> There's a little phone. What's in here? Rock and gem dig. Wait, wait, wait. Smithsonian. What's this? Oh, oh, that's cool. So this, what's that called? An ammonite? Am, ammonite or something like that? Fossil, basically. That's a cool piece. I like it. And then a couple little stones there. Polished stones. Nice. Samsung charger here. All right. Oh, that's nice. Samsung tablet here. Model SM-T230NU. Looks like it's in good shape. The screen's not cracked or anything. Oh, man, more books. And a nook. Sweet. Good. Oh, I got a lot of junk in here, too. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is Zebra. These, um, hmm. <laughs> I just listed one on eBay that I found in a different locker. These are for scanning, like for inventory or something in stores. That one's really dirty, but I think I listed for 30 or 40 bucks. Hasn't sold yet, but um, they have some value right here. Probably I should buy a charger so I could test it and be able to sell it, you know, as tested, working, whatever. Okay, there's a little Kenobi walkie-talkie. And another good little charger there. Mm -hmm. Not sure what that is. Books. Yeah, as I laid dying. That sounds like happy music. Oh, there's a um, sleeve for the Kindle right there. Oh, and there's another Kindle. Wow. Connect your Kindle to a power source. There's two Kindles. Oh, my goodness. That's like three Kindles we found in there. Lamb of God. At least his CDs have mostly been in, in the cases, you know? Sometimes you find a locker and there's like hardly any of them in there. Kodak, that's a, is that a phone or a camera or both? Don't know. Nickelback, I don't think that qualifies as hard rock. <laughs> Definitely rock, but not hard rock. Empty. Portable PA speaker. Oh, that's kind of neat. Yeah, that's kind of neat. You know what? The flea market, you could use that. Dollar sale. Get your dollar sale. Oh, nice. There's Godzilla. Sweet. Wrecker. LFL. Isn't that Lucasfilm? Hmm. Okay, there's another phone. Alcatel. Right. Oh, I just sold something else. 70 bucks. Halcyon Days. One of those little trinket boxes. Nice. Okay, and then at the very, very, very bottom, Klein Tools right here, ET900. I have to put that aside. That might be that might be worth a few bucks. Klein Tools often have some value to them. Oh, gross! This bag is making a mess. Why is that? Okay, I did see this. Something sticking out right there. It looks like doo doo. No, it's probably just mud. It doesn't smell. Well, okay. That may have been because it was raining when I was loading this, and it may have got dropped in a puddle or something I don't know there you close okay <laughs> well one nice thing about doing this on the packing station is you get it dirty just clear this clear this space I kids clothes here on top kids clothes kids clothes just making sure uh, me well, let me get the kids' clothes out, and we'll see if there's anything different below it. Okay, at the bottom of there, that was that's what was poking out was the leg of this hamper. But the hamper's Winnie the Pooh, so I, I don't, I don't know if anyone's gonna want that. But it's still kind of nice. Uh, a lot of blankets in here. Let's see if there's anything else. I did find one thing in here. Right on top, it was the baby book. You know, with that photos of the newborn baby i'll get that back to the owner i put it with their high school diploma and some other stuff that we already put aside this little baby gift bag thingies okay <laughs> there's a little what is this 49ers little 49er shirt oakland athletics jersey for little kids giants got all the teams yep look at that sharks 
Don't look at me, that smell is coming from daddy. That's funny. I'm a princess, mommy's a queen, daddy's around here somewhere. Funny. MVP, all star. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, what's that? Darth Vader, but it's Angry Birds swim trunks for a little kid. I don't know if I should put little kid stuff aside, guys. I don't think this does exceptionally well in our auctions, but I did put a couple pieces aside, which I thought were funny. Look at this. Don't mess with my daddy right there, a little onesie. And then a nice little boy's Star Wars t-shirt. It's cool. I don't know. Should we put this stuff aside for auction? Um, I don't know. I'll put it aside. We'll make up our minds later. And if I didn't mention before, guys, I know we talked about the auction or I promoted the auction, whatnot, meaning whatnot, you know, but uh, did I tell you there's 15 bucks off? If you use the code on our video here, it's also on our website, lockernuts.com. If you use that code, you can get $15 in free spending credits. And that is uh, on whatnot. They're giving that to you just to try them out. It's a great offer. They're sure you're going to have fun. I'm sure you're going to have fun. Come over and find out what we're talking about. You know, see what the hype's about. 15 bucks, but it's only when you first sign up and only if you use that link. So make sure that you use that link when you initially sign up for whatnot. If you're already on whatnot, you don't get that 15 bucks. Only for new, new users. All right, this is another uh, clothing bag. It looks like it looks like it got more men's clothes, and that's 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 good. These we should be able to get two to three bucks if we hang them up at the market. And that's what I'm gonna do. Okay guys, a uh, big old stack of clothes right here. All right, and it's all dress clothes, dress shirts rather, almost all black or dark gray, which I think is good. That's an extra large. This is triple X, but I think they're mostly XL and double XL. I see XLs, but then I pulled this out. Look at this. <laughs> Bay Island Sportswear. I think it's not that old, but it's cool. Iron Maiden. Killers. I think that must be one of their albums. I don't really know, but it doesn't look like it's worn very much. And then we got some more interesting stuff in here. Let me clear this out. Maybe we got some more t-shirts in there. Oh, hey, right here. Oh, this is older. What is this? Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Look at all the holes in this thing. It's pretty cool, though. Slayer. It's not a single stitch, it's a double stitch, but look at this. Wild Oats, large. Wow. I'd say that's probably a pretty old shirt, but again, not double stitch. Just been washed a million times to get that condition. But I'll tell you, there are collectors out there that want this condition. They want to go to the Slayer concert and they want their shirt to look like they've been wearing it, you know, for 30 years or whatever. And that's what that looks like. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. That's a good find. Okay, more kid clothes. What's this? Father and son, best friends for life? What? Right. That's not that's not what I thought. I thought it was gonna be cool. <laughs> not cool. Okay, there's the Iron Maiden one. Put that aside. Dress pants. Yeah, a bunch of slacks here. Okay. Now genuine leather right here in this little bag. I don't know if this has ever been used. Little satchel. Yeah, silica gel in there. Well, I don't know if that's ever been used, but I'll put it aside. Maybe we auction that, maybe we don't. I don't know. We really only pick the best stuff to get auctioned. And even though that's leather, it's 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 nice, but I just I just don't know. This one's also leather. This leather has a little bit more subtle sub uh subtle feel, a little softer. Huh. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, that one I'll let go. Eddie Bauer on this one. Hmm. All right, that's it for that bag because this thing right here is empty, I think. Let's make sure. Yeah, it's just a little overnight bag. Wait, what's this? Nah, kid stuff. Well, Luna's appreciating one find I found in there. This was in the garbage bag. No, this was in the toys with all the toys. <laughs> Over here. What's that? What's that? <laughs> she gets overexcited. Right here. <laughs> Luna, you're just like a little kitten. She's 10, but she's still got some spunk in her. <laughs> she's fast, and her claws are really sharp. I don't ever cut them because she's now in and out. You know, she's a garage cat, so she goes in and out. I want her to be able to defend herself. She got beat up pretty badly a few years ago. I don't know if it's a neighborhood cat or a raccoon that got her, but she was she was in bad shape. So I don't cut her nails anymore. I want her to do some damage to protect herself. Hey, kitty. Is that fun? 
All right, guys, so it's going to stop raining here in a couple hours. So I think I will. I'll try to get bags that aren't closed because the clothes bags are really heavy. They're really heavy. So I'll try to keep those out there. So I have to carry them all the way in the garage and then all the way back. So these ones, miscellaneous. And but this right here, I really like Godzilla. I, li I just love Godzilla, but that's a neat looking toy right there. Hmm. Yeah, that's cool. Hmm. Maybe I'll go find a place for him up on the shelf somewhere. Maybe up there. I don't know. That's kind of neat, though. I usually try to keep some kind of trophy or something, memento from the good lockers. There's a Stanford um, hat by Nike right there. 49ers. Very, oof, very dirty inside, but that's cool. I mean, it's whatever. It's 49ers, so. Okay, a little bit more books here. Oh my goodness, look at this. There's a San Francisco 49ers hammer, a real hammer. <laughs> That's not that's not a plate thing. Wait, oh, that glue came off of that. That's really funny. <laughs> Another 49. No, Giants this time. Hat. That's some earmuffs. US cellular. I think we'll throw that away. We'll just put that in a big lot of phones. Oh, here's some more. TCL, Samsung. All right, and there's a Nerf gun. Looks like we're missing maybe part. Maybe not. People have commented from that first video saying that uh, Nerf guns can be big money. Vintage Nerf guns. I don't think I have those, but we found a lot of them. So maybe there's a chance we do. Whatever we got, is it's headed to... There's a Spider-Man sweatshirt. Extra large, but that's, I think... A, ah, is that a kid's extra large? Maybe not. All the Nerf guns, I think, are headed to Stockton. So tomorrow, I'm going to be hitting Stockton. Oh, that's nice. Golden State Warriors sweatshirt. Nice. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to Stockton, so we'll find out. Another one. Santa Cruz, California. That's cool. Looks like a Heineken. Extra large. Yeah, I guess so. Nice. That's, those should be $10 items. Something's making noise in here. <laughs> Beast mode. Some little darts. Pretend phone right here. x shot. Oh, that one had a dart in it. Funny. Got some more lightsabers. Oh yeah, this is kind of neat right here. This, but it's, uh, yeah, a little bit nicer. This is metal, but it looks like he used to have a, probably a, oh, his mouth's busted off too. See that? It looks like he used to have a crystal ball or something right there, a glass ball. So, dang it. They broke it. They broke it. <laughs> what's that, Luna? She don't like it. This is what's making the noise. All right. Okay, what's this? Old journal or something. Notebook. Project planner. Project planner. And next box. Wait, maybe not. All right, one more phone. And another nice little charger. All right, next box. Next box. Shoes. More toys. More shoes. Underwear. What's this? Yeah, that's kind of neat. It's like a big flag. World Series Champions 2012. That's, that is neat. I'm going to clip it up right here. It's a flag. That's cool. That's Mickey Mouse, but that's just little kid pants there. Little kid stuff. Yeah, more little kid stuff here. Yep, something better. Maybe, a little bit. It's a little car. Action. Jimmy Johnson. Is it Hot Wheels? New Year, huh? New Year van. All right. And then we got a bunch of Nerf darts here. <laughs> Mini erasers, a whole bag of them. Is it Hot Wheels? <laughs> a lot of shoes. I was hoping for something better in this one, to be honest with you guys. Yeah. Cadillac. Cadillac brand shoes. I think this is Cadillac right there. Net spend, some kind of swag bag from maybe a convention or giving employees or something, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, what's this? 
a little better. San Francisco Giants. Three-time World Series champions. 2010, 2012, 2014. That's nice. Size extra large. It should be five to ten bucks at the market. All right. The rest appears to be clothes and shoes. Okay. These are the only uh, bags left. So we had a briefcase and a backpack. This is it. I mean, we have garbage bags still in one cardboard box, but this is it for the like little bags. Oh yeah. It's almost looking like a diaper bag right here. Some Nerf darts, NHL ball. Hmm. Oh, look at this though. Google Daydream View. Again, like dirty packaging, but it is shrink wrap brand new. 99 bucks, charcoal. So we'll have to look that up. Wow, that was in here. This is heavy. That sounds like, that almost sounds like jewelry in there, guys. Okay, there's some little toys in there. Whoa, look at this. Ooh, that's empty, but it's a jewelry bag. It was a yeah, bracelet. It's wicked. Oh, okay, look at this. Some of this stuff goes together. There's that. Cradle for this little Polaroid camera. What is this? Polaroid, no, HP. Never mind. <laughs> Another sound machine. It's like the pirate one we found. Hmm. Ooh, there's an eyeball on that one. Little dice with the cross there. Tom Brady, he's a, a football card. This, this, some of the stuff is like really random. World Series poker chip right there. We found a bunch of poker chips already. Angry Birds, Star Wars. I think it's a um, bookmark. Okay. I don't know if this is worth anything right there. I'll have to look that up. Little speaker. All right, but this. Do you hear that? It sounds like jewelry. Oh, it's dice. Oh, funny. Funny. Because we found that one dice. Okay, that's that's actually kind of good right here. We do sell dice. I'm not sure what these guys are or why they're in there. Oh, God. <laughs> it sounds like jewelry, but I think that was just my wishful thinking. Yeah. Dice. A couple of dominoes in here for some reason. There's a Star Wars dice. Darth Vader. Yeah, you know what? This is cool. That's a good find. I think we found a couple other dice, too. So we'll have to uh, dig those out and add it to that. That's that's a good little find. It is. Okay, next box. Ah, box. Oh, man. No more books. No more books. Oh, jeez. It's for baseball cards, and there's no cards in it. Okay. Yeah, this is a little bit, a little bit of promise in here, maybe, maybe. Got my hopes up a little bit. Come on. The chargers. Okay, what do we got in here? What? Ooh. Oh, photos. All right, we'll get that back to them. Okay. All right, a little AM/FM radio. 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 Oh, this is a Nike bag right here, too. I didn't even notice that. Hmm. Oh, and that's Air Jordan right here. <laughs> oh, it's cut, though. Okay. Husky, a little box cutter, and one of these cutters. These are great. Check it out. I got one right here. <laughs> given to us by, given to me by our friends. They came and visited us at the Deanza Flea Market. Thanks, you guys, again for that. Clever concept. Cool, 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 cool. All right, what else we got here? Hmm. Spotify gift card. Ay, ay, ay. But wait, there's more. Hmm. Sharpie pens, those are brand new sealed. These silver ones are cool too. Put those aside. I'm not exactly sure why they keep this stuff. Netflix, okay. Transformers instruction booklet. Put that aside. Dad, you're impressive. Most impressive. <laughs> oh, money envelopes. Come on. Empty. Empty. All right, he grabbed them out of the ATM. Nothing's in there. Boo. All right, we'll see if anybody wants this, though. And there's another Nike bag with stinking box. Actually, there's something in here. 
Oh, a little something. Okay. <laughs> Giant's lanyard right there. Some school supplies. Oh, look at this. Limited edition 2005 LFL Star Wars Episode 3. Little collector coin and a giant's thing. Okay, this is, a, this is all right. Marvel the Punisher. Little car die cast. Giants. Giants hum, Hummer right there. And then giant stuff. All right, that was cool. That's a nice little surprise right there. All right, guys. Supposed to be done raining, but it is uh, still just slightly drizzling. But I don't want to go through all those clothes. I gotta carry it all through this tight little area and back there. And some of these bags are heavy, so we're gonna start going through them out here. This one already went through. One, two, three, four, five bags, one box, still to go. <laughs> okay, guys, I feel a little deja vu. Like, <laughs> we just did this, we did it. Like two videos ago, I was doing the exact same thing. A little sprinkle, sprinkle while we're working out here. All right, this is not a garbage, uh, garbage. Right here, it's garbage can, it's garbage bag. It's not garbage. It's gonna be stuff go to the market. Yeah, that's cool. A little onesie for a shark, for a kid. We're just gonna go through this real quick and transfer everything from one bag to another. And of course, toss to the side anything that looks a little more interesting. Some A's pajama bottoms. All right, I'll go through this quick, guys. I'll, I'll let you know what good stuff we find. All right, not so good this time. That is just all going to the market. Just a couple things. This little Minnie Mouse uh, tie, almost like a Beanie Baby. Oh, it is a Beanie Baby, technically. So Minnie Mouse, any Disney we'll put aside. I found two more pairs of the Victoria's Secret leggings. Still haven't found any Juicy, no, not Juicy, what do you call it? Uh, Lululemon, but two more Victoria's Secret. Maybe they're $5, I don't know. But each, you know, too short, born to Mac right there it's a size medium the original oakland mac yeah two shorts from oakland so that's kind of cool to find his shirt in oakland and then a little star wars shirt here yoda is santa claus and that is a size large so kind of neat that is it though guys out of that entire bag okay jenna's in for a few minutes give her a bag of clothes to go through you can just drop it right in here this will go to the flea market okay larry levine pants. just let it go we don't um just look for the Lululemons. Oh, were there some? No. <laughs> <laughs> There's Victoria's Secret. I found four pairs of Victoria's Secret uh, yoga pants, and they are like almost brand new. Oh, well, but that's cool. I was looking for Lululemons, but I found yeah. that. Oh, there we go. T-shirt. I maybe. love Lululemons. That's what I'm wearing right now. Next level. It's soft. Okay. If you want it to go to Deanza, put it over here. That's what I was just going to say. Yeah. Wow, that's colorful. Oh, wow. Like a weapon. Wear Feel that how too. hard that is. Wear it's, that to the. It's Victoria's Secret. Oh well, we'll take it to the Manza, I guess. Mm. It's a dollar or two at Stockton, so. Whoa! Wait a minute. They're trying to make it look like a fancy brand. I think we found another PJ bag. That's pretty worn. Morona. That's old Target. They don't make that brand anymore. They don't. I haven't Victoria's been in the Secret. Target in a long time. It's sturdy and worn. When it has the balls on it, like a lot of balling, it's not as desirable for people to resell. Yeah, the condition's got to be. Oh, Cal, that's good. Unless it's vintage. Right yeah, here, that's Cal Berkeley, yeah. that's popular. Yeah, we could throw that to the Dianza. That maybe five bucks, right? Yeah, and let's see if it's. I mean, we no, prefer double. we prefer ten dollars shirts, but we'll take five dollar at this point because we don't really have enough merchandise for our next Dianza trip. That's is that condition it's a issue or is that actually see through? No, it's it? a fabric. It was kind of huh. popular in the early two thousands. Okay. That look, it's. We'll put it in there. Just give it a, give a little it a out try. of style, but maybe somebody we'll still wants to a, rock it. We'll give it a try. Marona. Okay, let's see. What's up, bro? Jeez, honey. <laughs> Seems so enthusiastic about that. Kids all call each other bra. 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 Or bra. What's up, bra? Bra. What's up, bro? So mostly Target and Walmart so far, <clears throat> which are solid. I mean, a lot of people wear I love Target sometimes. Oh, okay, wait, another. Cal? Champion Berkeley. I don't know oh, Berkeley. Okay, I don't know who went to college around here because they had like Stanford and Berkeley stuff. Maybe they just support the Bay Area colleges. Or maybe they worked there. I don't know. Or something. He worked at like a check cashing place. I miss my mom. That's sad. Yeah. That's and tagged. Tagged, which is great. I'll Someone will love that. Head. Someone will love that. Wait, you don't want to do Deanza with the tags? It will not tell her. Mm. I'm just telling you. Okay. Customers, like She's telling me. 20-year-old college 
like hipsters. Yeah, that's who. That's not the everyone that's at the market, but that's who's buying the clothes, right? Yeah, it's the young kids. Yeah, youngsters, the young whippersnappers. Maybe something's in there. Yeah, maybe at some point. Dun, some... The shower cap. That's a jewelry bag. Yeah. It's a jewelry bag, right? Yeah, they use them for travel. Yeah. And then what? when he says K, that means hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting boring. Aquafun. It's getting boring in here. <laughs> Neiman Marcus. Wow. Let's get to a different box bag. Light. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, sir. Mm. Santa Cruz. Santa Cruz. They have some cool Santa Cruz stuff. The conditions on this is a little rough, though. Yeah. That's what you're talking about. What's it called? Oh, Piling? Days. Yeah. Piling. And then that's, yeah. And the, and honestly, the resellers look at that. Yeah, of course. They really do. This is great. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, this is nice. It's a Reebok. It's oh, an extra yeah. large. That's good. And, uh, you that's, check that over there. That's probably that's five bucks, style. though. That's not going to be a $10, right? No, it's probably five. Five. Next bag. Next bag. Valentine's Day is coming up. I was doing the work while I drink the boba. Uh, who got you that boba? You did. Briefly stated, heart chones. Woo woo. Happy Valentine's Day, honey. I got you a present. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not where I'm not. <laughs> okay. Jerry Rice, baby. Yay. 80. That's a starter. Mm. Large. That's great. That's old. Jerry Rice, baby. That's good. Yeah, that's a that's a really Especially good. Especially this weekend. Oh, yeah. Heck, yeah. Oh, I see some more sports stuff. Gianna's getting pumped. All Wilson. right. Wilson. Yeah. That's a nice this one. Is... Size 52, double X. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Majestic. Or maybe it's a little extra. Large. That's great. great. Come on, All right. jerseys. I got some more chones. Soles on it. That'll sell. Super. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This is good. Yeah, I'm pumped. Cooperstown, Will Clark. Yeah. Wait. This right here. Yeah, it's Cooperstown. It's nice. It's a Nike, huh? Cl Will Clark. Yeah, good. Nike and Will Clark. Double win on that. Hmm. Okay. Next up, more. Oh, look. Yeah, I World found a couple series. of those already. That's good, right? Yeah, that's that should be great. 10 bucks. 100%. I don't know. We'll try 10 bucks. Baseball season starting. So, spring yeah, training. Yeah, but does anybody really watch baseball anymore? Uh, not as well, I don't as much. This one looks new. 2010. Wow. And good sizes on this. Yeah, extra yeah, large. Extra large and double XL is his size. So, those good are really good news. for selling, for resale. Dirty socks. Not a big fan. Better than dirty underwear. This is a point. Cute little Santa. We'll take those to the market. We? Oui. You will. Well, depending on which market, yes. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, that's Stockton, so. Don't knock me. And it's here. Still yet to experience the Stockton market. 2010. And these look really Someday. Like, never she was worn. really excited to go there someday. Though. Maybe for like our anniversary or something for a present, I'll go. <laughs> orange. The orange is nice. Mm. 210. I love that. 2010. That's these... 14 years old. So. I'm telling you, these are not been worn. No, I, I, I think you bought a lot of Look clothes. At the tags. I mean, mm -hmm. just on the volume of clothes, I don't yeah. think they wore no. some of this stuff. All right, San Francisco Niners going this weekend. <laughs> Join us. I can go to Stockton. A lot of Valentine's Day in 49ers. Yeah, they love the Niners, the Giants, and the Sharks. Just so you know, this love is the going A's to the flea bit. market, not... A, uh, A's got a little love Gosh, and... Brand new. World Series. Mm. Jeez. 2010 again. Yeah, well, that's their era. And they only had a little bit of, of uh, Warriors. <laughs> Another one. Jeez. 2010. Brand new. Yeah, that's good. Gosh, I'm happy right now. Nike, this is very nice. Nike athletic fit. Is it a compression shirt? Yeah. Or? Oh, no, it's a athlete. Manny. Which Manning's 99? Mm, I'm not oh, sure. I don't think, oh. Maybe that was Pro Bowl or something. Like, Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Another champion shirt. Brand new. He also was a Sharks fan. He's got a Sharks towel. Yeah, gang I'll towel. i to the side too because I don't know. Oh, 49er hinky. <laughs> Jeez. A little scrap. Giants. Uh, That's cool. It's ripped. Oh, and, and re-sewn. And, yeah. Yeah, I would let that go. Uh, stain tea. Let's see what this bad boy is. It is Manning as well. Nike extra large. Manning. Hmm, I'm not sure. 99 again? Yeah. And that's a Nike, like a windbreaker? It's a Nike jacket, which is like got some good value. This has a school on it. Marvel. Marvel. Oh, it's Punisher. Yeah, this. Yeah. Nice. What do you want to do with that? Yeah, I'll go. Oh, more Let's Punisher. Marvel. Yeah, you like Punisher too. That's good. It's like a Letterman soft jacket. You go to the Deanza with it. If it doesn't sell at Deanza, then it will go to Stockton. Sometimes they get demoted when they don't sell. We take it out, you guys, and if it doesn't sell, then we take it to Stockton. That's so creepy. It's a, yeah, a costume. Is it a cloak? Oh, a costume. So, socks. That is definitely some Yikes. better days. yellow. Socks. Mellow yellow. We sell those. Satin chones. Satin? <laughs> These socks look new. 
They do. Yeah, those look good. Yeah, they don't. They don't really look worn at all. No, they're new. Yeah, someone might go through and pull all the socks Little out. Little elf costume. I better bring a big tarp because we're gonna have a lot of clothes that are gonna get dumped on it. Dear Santa, I was framed. I was framed. Do you think we should do a lot of children's clothes in the auction, live auction? So I put aside a couple of cool pieces. Um, I don't know. I mean, I'd have to see them to make that call. All right, we gotta move quick. It's the boss. Manning. This one's not as in a good condition. It's Nike though. It's discolored. It's colored around the corners. All right, but... just dump it then. I mean, it's not dumb, but I just think No, it's... going to Stockton means we're dumping it. Yes, sir. You're getting a dollar at best, and that's not, that does not make a difference in your life, a dollar. Well, a dollar sells a difference. No, they don't oh, add up to very much. Ooh, my. there we go. Yes, but it's a newer one. So what? It's still cool. Wait. It is. Yeah, it's yeah. newer, but mm -hmm. still it's extra large. Yeah, destroyer. it's nice. It's cool. Finally. Okay, that's. We might put those in the live auction, right? I, we're going to put some. We already promised we would. Living Deadlights. Yeah. That looks like an old tag, though. Looks aged. All right, we'll put that aside. We have a... That's the Undertaker. That's his uh, logo and that's his hat. And it's authentic. Oh. It's a wrestling brand. Extra large. Yeah. This is interesting. Okay, this we could that's, auction off. Let's oh, put this in totally. auction. Yeah. yeah. A few miscellaneous kid stuff. Never give up. Never give up. All right, that's it, right? That's it. That's all she wrote, baby. Okay, guys, I'm pulling out all the stuffs. <laughs> I need both garbage cans for this job. <laughs> it's just good. So I found this bag. Uh, this was buried under another bag, so we have one more additional bag, more than what I thought we had. And I see some garbage in here, so let's let that go. To the dump. What's that? My little stickers and stuff probably decorated one of the kids' rooms. Alright, okay, a little cushion, dead inside, hmm, okay, I'm not sure why you would want to glorify that, put it on your wall, that's, oh, dang, that's too bad, that was kind of cool, if that was, oh, you know what, that was, there's all this black sand in there, I had to get my um, vacuum out to suck it up, this was, yeah, you see the black sand in there, it's a little bit, a little tiny bit left, it all spilled out, and it spilled in my van, so, that's too bad that broke, but I mean, come on. You're storing glass in garbage bags? What do you expect to happen? But now I gotta be careful. Uh, that would have been a pretty cool hourglass. Okay, we're gonna have to put that right in the garbage so I don't get cut. Now I gotta be careful too, because now I know there's broken glass in there. A little flip phone. A little ring here, but that's it's nothing, nothing. You know, it's not gold or anything. A little phone. Those are plastic. Okay. There's some light bulbs, 100 watts. Some connectors. This is good stuff. This will sell at the market. A couple bucks, you know. Stainless steel. Uh, or was it brushed nickel finish on that? And that's good. Sell that. A few bucks. Screen spline. That's for uh, redoing the screens on your windows and stuff. Oh man, look at this. They put light bulbs just loose in here. Gross, yikes. Scared to put in there. I'm gonna take a chance. All right, we'll use that. Put that aside. Yeah, that's all right. Light bulbs too, hmm. Sandpaper. A little bit of tools. Oh wow, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Phones galore. And a little, oh, this is powered on right here. Verizon. This, I think, is for your car, like a uh, speakerphone. A little camera. All right, that one's cracked up. Nokia. All right, it's a couple cameras and phones and tablets, and we'll add the electronics to that. We might just put all those in one big flat rate box, sell them all as a lot. Okay. What's this? Xfinity. Bunch of cassettes here. Hmm. I see Kiss right there. 49ers football, 1991. Alright. It's a little brass piece. I don't think anyone's going to buy those, but I will take it to the market and we'll let them figure it out. PayPal prepaid MasterCard? What? What? Western Union? I don't know. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. 
There's some forever stamps. It's like three bucks in stamps. A little bit more. A couple bucks more. I've, I haven't had to buy stamps in forever. <laughs> forever. Jeez, light bulbs. Okay, what's that? Feline facial pheromones. That's weird. Screen door, P oh, a handle for your screen door right there. Oh, look at this. Classico San Francisco, 1999, kiss. Little coffee mug, okay. Oh boy, I just broke that. <laughs> not not especially very good uh, quality piece there if I can break it that easy. Oh, there's some little fold-up glasses there. Foster Grants. Hmm, those are cool. Yeah, it looks like this cleaned out a junk drawer or something here. Probably in the kitchen, right? Based on that stuff. Long flathead wood screws held up blind holders on top, short wood screws. Okay, next bag, and this is a uh, clothes bag, as we thought it would be. So, uh, starting out with little kid clothes, that's a, not a good start, but let me go through it. As we do it, I'll update you if there's some good stuff. That bag i already been through, too. It's getting a little embarrassing here. Um, there's just bags everywhere. There's stuff everywhere. Okay, I started putting in there stuff we already gone through. We got one box to go through, that cardboard. But, yeah, there's just, like, there's stuff everywhere. It's getting a little confusing. No, what, I went through what I didn't. So it looks like we're down to two bags and a cardboard box. Let's wrap this up. Okay. Oh, got more, more hanging clothes in here. Yeah, more of the same brands we found before. Let's... It's decent. Uh-oh, there's something good. Oh, man. Get ready for that flea market tomorrow. Put that stuff in the back seat. Okay, this is better, right? Iron Maiden, the number of the beast. Okay, all style, heavyweight, extra large. It's a newer shirt. It doesn't look like it's worn very much. So that'll probably go in our live auctions. I mean, I'll tell you what, guys. We got a lot of requests for those kinds of clothes t-shirts in our live auction we've done them in the live auctions before they just haven't done that well so quite frankly you just as soon bring them to the market where people can inspect them try them on if they want determine for themselves if it's vintage or not and yeah, that's this feels like it's leather but i'm not sure there's nothing in it it's kind of decent there's a cat bed or a dog bed i guess it's a dog bed because it's kind of large well, that'll sell Oh boy, that one is... Look at that. <laughs> that one's seen better days. That is not real leather. Okay. More dress clothes. Oh, there's another Manning piece here. And this is a Nike dry fit jacket. Uh, I think I'll put that aside. Croft and Barrow. A brand new dress shirt right there. Another one right here. Easy care. This is a brand new. Never, never worn. Maybe, maybe I'll bring this to the better. And eh, let's just let it go. Dress clothes don't sell at Danza for some reason. Or I should just say we haven't had luck with those. I'm sure they do sell, which is not for us. Huh. Got a little skull on his tie. Once again, there's like little kid stuff and adult stuff all mixed together. Kind of gives you gives you insight into someone's household and lifestyle like that there's this a little bit of chaos going on it's Darth Vader comforter right there yeah that's it all right guys last bag then one more box look at the little beating of water up here it's still drizzling down the weather report said it was gonna be done it is not done I wish it were whoa look at that one <laughs> ripped up so uh, like I said earlier tomorrow I'm going to Stockton flea market so even if this stuff gets a little moist it will not be um, stored in plastic for very long you know it's gonna get out in the open it'll get dried off it's supposed to be sunny out there tomorrow which I'm very excited about get me some vitamin D and it'll put customers in a good mood I think first uh, first Sun in a few days right <laughs> next man up <laughs> Okay, that was better. Um, that's all going going back to the stock in there. But look at this. I put get, put aside some decent stuff. There's a bunch of nice dress shirts here. They're not on hangers, but they probably should be. Look at this. Mark Anthony right here. Price tag on that's 54 bucks. 
54 bucks that's that's decent this is stuff we probably uh, here's claiborne brand new with tags 60 bucks this is stuff we probably should hang up we usually don't do that kind of work at the uh stockton but this stuff might be worthy the apartment nine stuff but it's it's pretty nice I don't know how expensive for apartment nine. So anyways, this stuff I'm going to stick inside the van, or the truck rather, and keep it with the hanging clothes. Look at this. Crofton Barrow, 28 bucks, brand new. Apartment nine, brand new. London Fog right here. That's kind of a nice looking shirt. Extra large. Maybe I'll take that to the market. I don't really know. But check this out, guys. Anyways, Slayer right here. Slayer. It's got a year 2006 Slayer. So not super old. Long sleeves. Got the print on the sleeves too. It is super cool. Not super old. Just super cool. Look at this 49ers right here. That is thrashed. I don't know if this is what a collector would want. It's a sleeveless shirt. It's pretty cool. But I don't think so. But I'm going to take it to Dianza. We'll find out. Look at this. Golden State Warriors jersey. Nice quality. Uh, it says Manning on it. So I have a feeling someone's last name in their family was Manning. Adidas extra large. It's a really nice jersey. I don't know if somebody's going to want that. And then this one, all right, Spider-Man. Very faded out. Looks like it's been worn a bunch. That's the Todd McFarlane cover. It says Torment. And um, that's extra large. That is my size. And that's a keeper. That one's a keeper, guys. All right, so let's get to the cardboard. So this one is taped up. Never been opened in a while. And looking inside. Oh, geez, that's a great start right there. What is this? Joe Montana career set. Oh, yes. Got some football cards right here that's cool guys very cool all right that anyways that's just a start okay oh this looks interesting this looks kind of interesting i didn't save this for last for any reason wwe wrestling uh tape spider-man did not mean to do that uh oh there's the popo guys what's the popo doing down there hmm Finger football. <laughs> that's funny. Mark Dean collection. Yeah, that's kind of neat. America. San Francisco Giants uh, luggage tag right there. We'll put that in the Giants lot. What about this? All right. I just let it go, I guess. Body alarm. Hmm. These are kind of roached. The wires are sticky and stiff. I'll let that go. Okay. Ear band right here keep the ears warm there's some san francisco for, uh giants and then some san francisco 49er gloves we'll put those in our lots we're gonna make big lots of sports stuff high heat baseball right there I'll let that go Ooh, look at this demon wind this is the um cover to a vhs tape and is that uh lenticular or whatever it's called is that what it's called i i almost think i had the same vhs before and sold it or maybe it's in my ebay store still i don't really know there's a little speaker we'll let that go oh, that's neat look at this wonder bread huh that's really cool 2006 got more giant swag in here that's neat okay there's some 42 tips what's this for a oh, laser pointer okay different laser pointer tips yeah, okay there's a lock look at this there's sealed uh film 200 35 millimeter uh, sealed. So, I don't, is there value in that? There might be a little bit. I'll put it aside. I don't think it's big money. Birthday card. Oh, man, what's this? Designed especially for you by Steve Young. Hmm, huh, that's weird. It's like numbered. I don't know. Is that worth anything, guys? It's a little different, but it's personalized with the guy's name in it. I don't know. It's got all this black powder from the broken hourglass that we found so look at this my bloody valentine little 3d glasses from when the movie came out i guess there's a few of them probably those are collectible too it's a little pen brand new metal pen freddy versus jason hs head cleaner business card holder <laughs> little pair of binoculars brand new but Probably a cheap giveaway, maybe at a game or something. Headphones. A little cassette player here. Ooh, this is nice. Mark McGuire, a little baseball card. My goodness, there is so much stuff in here. Charles Barkley. Luggage tag, another luggage tag. Team branded. 
another mini speaker. What's this? <clears throat> what is this? Uh, little skulls, Darth Vader. What the heck is this? I don't know. I don't know what these are. Hmm. I'll put that aside. I don't know what that is. Nightmare is alive. What? And sharks tag. 49ers. Little binoculars right here, I think. It says binox right there. Binox. Idea works. Yeah. Oh, that's dirty. A lot of this stuff is dirty. I think it was dirty before that black sand fell in it. This little Sonic the Hedgehog guy. It's a hide a key. Let's see what's in there. Oh, that's a bunch of keys. Hmm. These are just kind of thrash. We found a lot of good electronics, but it's something like that. It's just dirty, opened, thrashed. I'm just going to let it go. Nintendo Entertainment System Cleaning Kit. I might put that aside. Okay. A couple coins right here. Dirty ashtray. Vivitar camera there, 35 millimeter. Hmm. Oh, what's this, guys? Pastimes. Some movie tickets. Nah, there's something else in here. I can hear it jingling. Scary movie. Blair Witch. Pastimes. Alright, it's a little thing with Jesus on it. Could be silver right there. Not the chain, but the emblem could have some silver on it. I'm not sure. Put that aside. Mm, this is another Nintendo cleaning kit, I think, right there. I think that's what that is. Okay. And what's this? Sealed pack of cards. And lots of cleaning kits in here. Also a lot of locks. <laughs> My Bloody Valentine, more of those. Gosh, these things, look at this. This is just deteriorating the foam. And that's part of what's becoming a sticky mess in here. All these cards here, but guess what guys? I'm gonna just let those go to the market. They're all, they're a little sticky, you know? Unless it's like this. Charles Barkley in a plastic, I'll put that aside. These are probably protected right there. I'll put, I'll put those aside. Star Wars, top Trump specials. Hmm, huh. put those aside. These ones are okay. Put those aside. Okay, what's this? Ultimate Greg Litton scrapbook. Tribute to Greg Litton. Who's Greg Litton? <laughs> Greg Litton's a baseball player. Right. I wonder if Greg Litton was a good baseball player because these cards might be worth something. There's one. Okay. Oh, those little binoculars. Those are Tasco. Those are a little bit better. Baseball card game. There's a bark card with 40 cents. There's 40 cents, guys. <laughs> Pager, wallet, there's cassette player, mini cassette player. So I'm going to be going a lot quicker now, guys, because I'm yeah, getting to the bottom here. I haven't found anything good in a while. This sounds kind of good. What the heck? What did we just find here? Oh my goodness, if we just found some gold, that would be hilarious, because I just said we haven't found anything good in a while. Oh my goodness, okay. Definitely slow it down again. Oh! There's an old baseball, Jim Rhodes. Wow. Okay, there's an old card. Dang it, now I'm gonna have to go through everything very carefully. <laughs> I was just saying I'm gonna speed it up, now I'm gonna slow it down. A couple Star Wars playing cards. Skull candy. All right guys, I'm gonna dig through more of this stuff here and sort out garbage from good. I'll update you on some of the more interesting stuff that we find. All right, guys, I did not find that much interesting stuff in there. I found a little bit of stuff that I'll put aside. Uh, surprisingly, really not very much good stuff. Let's take a look at this real quick. First of all, first of all, we'll use the magnet to eliminate any non-gold that is uh, being attracted just slightly to the magnet. So that is not real gold. Boo! I actually thought this might be. It says 925 on it, but it is not. That is also being just slightly attracted to the magnet. Shouldn't be attracted at all. It also says 925. It is not. Also, 
No, it's not. That says 925 on it. That's not going to the magnet. It's probably silver. We want gold though. Come on. Nope. Ugh. That's being pulled too. This is 925. What a bunch of baloney. Okay, last chance here. Well, I don't think that is. 925. Okay. So this stuff we know is not. That stuff is a maybe. Okay. All right, guys, that's a wrap. And um, good timing, because actually that took me way longer than I thought. It's starting to get dark. You can see out there, it's starting to get dark. At least it stopped raining for the moment. <laughs> but I got to go, I got to jump my truck and go get my trailer. Trailer is um, ready to go to the market tomorrow. It's not completely super full, but it is it's front to back filled, just not all the way to the ceiling like I do it sometimes. But we got a pretty good load. I'm going to go out there tomorrow. Um, if you guys didn't know, I, I had some damage done to my trailer. I'll probably make a video talking about it when the time comes, but we did put out a little reel it got damaged by a defective gate at one of the facilities you know the facility actually where i got the madam coco locker the gate uh i think the sensor is defective and closed on my trailer as we we're leaving and smashed it up a bunch so gotta go empty the trailer out so it's like it's not full but i gotta get it empty so i can get it repaired so anyways guys it would be really nice to use the trailer for this locker because there's a ton of stuff in there still but i'll bring the trailer back we'll throw all the stuff we sorted to go to stockton on the trailer or the truck or both and get it gone tomorrow it's gonna be gone everything's gonna go tomorrow we're just gonna blast it out so um probably not a big sales volume day but it's gonna make a it's gonna be a big making things go away day and uh i'm happy about that we gotta we gotta get stuff moving not only do i have this locker finished cleaning out i also bought that second locker and it's a cram packed 10 by 10 it's like filled to the ceiling and that one's got some it's got some interest and intrigue and promise so maybe not promise <laughs> potential i should say uh, the p word potential so um got good stuff but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this one i have a feeling it's wound up being a long video but uh a lot of junk and a few surprises it seems like when we hit the good stuff we hit a streak of it and those jerseys were good we yeah, we had a little bit of good stuff we found some gold early on i think so we uh we're doing pretty good we're doing pretty good in this locker i don't know maybe we're a little past halfway through i don't know we'll get back to it in the next episode until then guys good luck to you god bless you and we'll see you next time here on Locker nuts.